Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Hope you're doing well. So Sagittarius, I was actually meant to do your reading before Capricorn. I'm doing the readings in order and I don't believe in coincidences or anything like that. Okay, I believe things happen for a reason. So for that to happen with your sign, that lets me know that some of you guys are feeling like you're being overlooked or not. Um, I'm not saying I don't appreciate you guys, but some something like, oh, Sagittarius will be fine. They'll, they'll cope, they'll, you know, they'll get on with it. There's that kind of energy, okay? Um, some of you guys could be feeling like that. Um, not everybody, but I know there's definitely a group of Sagittarius is like, maybe it's one of those things, Sagittarius, where you just get on with things and you don't always um, lean on others for um, uh, support, emotionally, emotional support, um, mental support, okay? And because at times you guys can come off as strong people are like oh they got this they're good Sagittarius is fine okay when really it's like actually I do need help but I may not always speak up on it all right so some of you guys are experiencing that maybe not maybe not now it could be throughout your life or it could be at, at this moment in time all right <coughs> excuse me um watch out for the scammers in the comments guys think they're taking my picture they're taking my name they're posing as me asking people to whatsapp them i don't have whatsapp i don't do readings that way i do do personal readings but i will never reach out and i don't have whatsapp okay all the information for personal readings in the description it will always be there all right guys um so please be mindful of that okay because there has been somebody that's been scammed okay and that's why it's so important to always listen to the whole message not just skip to certain parts okay because i could be trying to make you guys aware of something to prevent something to have from happening all right guys so I'm going to see what comes out for you guys. But before that, I want to see what your angels want you to know right now. OK, so first message 151. Your confidence is growing and will encourage your gifts and talents to surface. Continue to trust in yourself. OK, continue to trust in yourself. And I feel like that's what it is. It's like there's, there is this sense of confidence when it comes to you guys, to you Sagittarius's. And it makes you don't always... It's going to differ from each Sagittarius, but um, a lot of the Sagittariuses that I have met um, don't always show how they're feeling. Don't always, they kind of keep it very deep, okay? And it's only really when they know somebody really, um, really feel connection with somebody, that's when they will open up, okay? Um, as free-spirited as a Sagittarius is, they won't always... Um, unlock Pandora's box they won't always do you know what I mean it's there's a time and a place for them and yeah there is it is a trust in trust in them as well they know they have they get their back but it's like will you have my back like how I, how I have my back all right anyways seven three four your angel team is revealing truths including an understanding of your current situation through energetic downloads, okay, so please um, listen to those, trust those, okay, it's happening for a reason. Take time to unlock these deep insights from heaven and the astral realm. Oh, so that's quite intense, guys, because I know when I was going through that and woo, sometimes you may not be ready to receive certain information, but believe you me, guys, whoever's going through that, um, it sounds all beautiful and pretty and all this stuff, but let me tell you something, when, you, when you've been asking for certain um, things, for clarity, for answers. The way you get it may not be the way that you're comfortable with. It is. It, it tends to be things that will really allow you to see the situation for what it is, whether it's been how you've been in the situation or how this person's been, how you've, okay. And it really does go really more towards you a lot of the time. Um, and not everybody is ready for that. And it can seem like a bit of a, it may feel like you're having a breakdown or a meltdown, or but is it part of the spiritual? Uh, for me, it was like um, for my experience, it's like a bit of a, um, awakening, a rude awakening, to say the least. Okay, so you're not going crazy. Okay, things are happening how it's meant to. You're you're receiving the information that you need to to help you on your path. Okay, all right. So that's your message, Sagittarius. Actually, did I pull three? One more. Forty three. Angels, your loved ones and guides and masters. Why have they put so many ands? Angels, your loved ones, guides and masters who support, who can support you are all with you now. Know that help is, is only a thought away. Exactly what I was just saying, okay? And they're telling you directly. So 
be prepared okay guys and be willing to accept too that you can move forward with whatever it is that you feel like you're um, battling right now okay or that you're experiencing right now all right Sag so let's get into your reading please tell me about Sagittarius what's currently going on with Sagittarius's please please tell me about Sagittarius's there's somebody I'm um, reminiscent about a time that you spent together um it could be, I got more of a lover thing. So somebody from your past, somebody that you're not currently connecting with, okay? Um, there could be distance between you and this person. I just got like, if I can only spend one night, if I can only spend one night. But if it doesn't feel like like this person wants to use you. It's just, I, I'm getting the energy that I felt when I just got that message was that this person misses being around you. I'm not sure if they've expressed this to you. I'm not sure if you feel it too. Okay. It's somebody from somebody that you're not currently around. Okay. It's not somebody that you see every day, it's somebody that you haven't been around. So they, they've been thinking about you. Okay. They do miss being around you. Okay. Tell me about Sagittarius, please. Um, I don't know if this is the same person. Um, why am I getting so many downloads with you guys? Um, there's some there's somebody, um, there was a rumour or something come out. I'm not sure if it was about you or somebody else. Um, somebody feels like they were lied on. I'm not sure if you believe the other person uh, that was telling the lies or sp spreading this rumour. Um, you may have sided with um, the person who was spreading the rumour. Be careful of that. Um, I feel like they have some kind of vendetta towards th that person or you. Somebody can't be trusted, so please be mindful of that. Okay, I'm having... E have your cake and eat it too. I'm just getting a shitload of downloads for you guys. Right, okay. Um, somebody's... Try it's funny because it's that's not even in a, in a romantic way that I'm getting. It's more like there's somebody somebody's a bit of a attention seeker, and it's like they they just want to they just like to have attention. They like being I don't know. It, it's it's difficult to. They need somebody's quite needy regardless of if it's good or bad attention be careful of that i don't know who that is five of pentacles the king of wands the five of swords so there's this fire sign it doesn't have to be we've got earth fire and air okay capricorn taurus virgo aries leo sag aquarius gemini libra why does this feel like there's this <laughs> There's this very fiery connection that you have with somebody. Don't worry about the signs. There's a very fiery connection that you have with somebody and it's like, I'm getting like this person, they show you at times that they want you. They chase you, they're very much on your case. They're on your ass, man. But like they, at times they have very spiteful things to say to you about you um there's times where you've pushed this person out you could have blocked them you could have kicked them out of your house they could have left themselves um i'm getting this but it feels like a very this feels i'm gonna say it it feels toxic it feels um like this person really gets you up in your emotions and in your head and 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 you do them as well but it, why does it feel like some kind of drug? I'm not saying literally a drug, but very um, addictive. This energy is addictive, okay? Is that is that why I was just saying about somebody liking attention, whether it's good or bad? Is that why that just come out? Okay. Um, mm, that's interesting. That's interesting. Um, okay, tell me more. Please tell me more about Sagittarius. So you have Nine of Pentacles, the devil. Well, I'm not, I'm not surprised. <laughs> I'm not surprised. 
uh, the page, uh, the two of pentacles, the three of pentacles and the page of wands. Okay. So this is either a situation where somebody doesn't like your independence for some, for some of you guys. Yeah. It's going to be different in each side. Take the messages that resonate with you and leave the rest. Okay, guys, don't confuse yourself. Um, if it's not for you. Okay. If it doesn't make sense, leave it. But there's something about somebody knowing that you're independent, knowing that you can do for yourself. And they could have dealt with in themselves. Some of you guys are dealing with the Capricorn. You've got to check that reading if you are, okay? Because something similar come out there. Definitely check it if, you if you're on the cusp of Sagittarius and Capricorn or if you're dealing with a Capricorn or they have it in their chart too. Three of Pentacles, Page of Wands. So there's a back and forth connection here, Sagittarius. There's a back and forth on and off. Very fiery, very spicy, very toxic at times, okay? Some of you guys can have addictions, okay? Drinking, smoking, um, the sex could be amazing. And then you argue, you bring something up, something comes to surface and you're like, ah, okay, okay. This person really gets you like nobody else gets you when i say get gets you i don't mean like understand you i mean like they get you in certain emotions like not many people do some of you guys are wondering why this person's around you why they're in your life why you feel this way towards this specific person because you may have met somebody who looked like this person or was, was similar to them in some kind of way but it's like something about this person something about this person why do they make you feel this way? What is it? That's what it feels like, okay? Tell me more, please. Empress. Some of you guys, you could be pregnant or they, they have children, you have children, okay? But I, tell me more about this Empress, please. It could be a Taurus. We've got Capricorn, Virgo. We've got the fire signs, yeah, like I've said before. Thank you. So we have the Ace of Pentacles and the Five of Cups. So there's... Someone's like, oh, um, Sagittarius, you know, you're my queen or you're my king. You know, um, I want this new start with you. But what is so? But why the five of cups and the five of swords? Is it because somebody lets you down? Do you feel let down in this connection? Do you feel like sometimes this person abandons you when you really need them? Is it their arguments, the way they speak to you at times? Is it the internal conflict? Is it is it maybe not them? It's you, your inner thoughts. It'll be it'll differ from Cap, uh, from Sagittarius to Sagittarius. Some of you guys, it is a Capricorn. Okay, tell me more, please. I just did Capricorn's reading. All right, so we have six of Pentacles. Someone's like, yeah, I'm going to try better. I'm going to do better. Right? I'm I'm trying. I'm really working on this. Not just this connection in life in general. I'm working towards this job. I'm working towards being a better person. Okay, give like give me a break. Give me a break. Get off my back get off my back so Sagittarius what is hap what's happening so some of you guys cross watchers it could be how you feel towards a Sagittarius absolutely fine um but what I'm getting is that somebody is not fully I'm not saying that they're not, they're not fully in the connection but what I do want to say is that they're not bringing all that they can offer to the connection okay um it feels like somebody's a bit behind whether it's their finances, whether it's their, um, how they interact with you, how they speak to you. And you're like, do you know what? I used to do that when I was 19 and I'm like, four, I'm like 35, 40 now, I'm 50. I don't do that. Do you know what I mean? And it's like, you, you expect more from this person is what I'm trying to say. You expect more. You're like, at your big age, that's how you're acting? At your big age, this is what you want for yourself. Why am I getting so, why I, I feel, now some of you guys, you watch the other signs, the other placements and you've been watching my readings for a while, you know if, I, if I'm a certain way in readings and I feel it and it feels fiery, I'm getting slightly um, irritated and I feel like um, I'm waiting for somebody to um, do better. I'm waiting for somebody to um, treat me, not me, but someone, someone here is wanting to be treated better or wanting to feel more safe. Somebody wants to feel more stable. Thank you. Somebody wants to feel more stable. Okay. 
Thank you. So we have the seven of cups, the devil. So somebody could be taking some kind of drugs or just have some kind of behavior which is causes confusion um, confusion here okay and someone's like or somebody's doing multiple things drugs they've got sex addiction they they're drinking they you know they're smoking a lot okay they're partying a lot whatever it could be or it could just be quite narcissistic okay and causing confusion somebody could be gaslighting here also but someone's like hey hey you know i'm trying to be a better person i'm trying i'm trying i'm trying so somebody here straight, when I say straight, I mean like someone here is on a straight path and the other person is not there or do you, do you know what I mean? Whether that be like somebody on a straight path when it comes to their work, it's legit work, how they make money, how they go about certain things in life, they're honest, they're reliable. The other person's like could be doing things that, you know, are illegal and they could be lying and stuff like that. So is like uh, okay <laughs> oh wow Sagittarius I'm getting a lot from you guys you guys is reading today interesting interesting um and this at times leaves you Sagittarius or Crosswatcher at times where it's like can we work on this two of pentacles three of pentacles can we work on this because it's like the page of ones and the empress is like you're saying these things, but you're not actually following through with them. So is somebody gaslighting you? Is somebody uh, emo uh, emotionally manipulating you? Page of Pentacles and the Knight of Pentacles. Yeah, you're like, I've been waiting ages. You said this, you said that. So what's, what now? So you feel like you're going around in circles with somebody, okay? For some of you guys, it may not be a love interest. It may be a friend, family member. It could be a business partner, okay? It could be your children for some of you guys, okay? It will be different for all of you guys. But um, they, I just feel frustration and this connection is so strong and intense. It really leaves both of you, whether some of you guys notice this or not, it leaves both of you in this energy of like, oh, you know, like, oh, come on, come on, you know. Somewhat, somebody feels annoyed. This one, whose reading was this that I did the other day? Aries. Check Aries reading out, guys. If this is resonating with you, check the Aries reading out that I did last. I can't remember what I was wearing. Check that out. Um, yeah, yeah, it was Aries. If this is resonating with you, it, it's not about I'm not dealing with the Aries or I don't have Aries in my chart. If this energy is resonating with you, trust me, watch the Aries reading, okay? You'll see why. All right. Um, I'm going to leave it there. I'm going to leave it there. Um, that was intense. If you'd like a personal reading, all the information is in the description, guys. Watch out for the scammers. They ain't got nothing better to do. Um, and I'll see you guys in your next reading. Bye, guys.